Hello everyone, this is Dr. Choi. Welcome to my formula class. Today we will learn the formulas expel wind. The formulas expel wind. So we have six formulas to cover today. And expelling wind can be interpreted in two aspects. First, releasing exterior and second, clear liver yang raising, internal wind liver wind. We actually learned releasing exterior formulas already in the first chapter. So slight difference are there. Releasing exterior and expelling wind. But many herbs will be common in both sides like Bai Chi and Fang Feng, Jing Jie and Jie Geng, Xi Xin. Those releasing exterior herbs will be found on this formula too, expelling wind formulas. But what is the difference then? Releasing exterior, the first chapter, we took care of the formulas treating common cold and respiratory symptoms and those cold-like symptoms. But in this chapter, expelling wind formulas are more related to internal wind, like a tremor, muscle spasm, or skin disease, or hypertension. So there is a slight difference. First formula is Chuan Shong Cha Tiao San, treat headache, and Chang Er Ji San, treat nasal blockage, rhinitis, allergies, and Xiao Huo Lo Dan, treat pain, and Xiao Feng San, treat the skin problems, and Zhen Gan Xie Feng San, and Tian Ma Ko Ting In, both treat liver yang raising, especially hypertension. Let's talk about these six formulas today. This is the first formula, Chuan Xiong Cha Tiao San. Chuan Xiong, yes, it is right. This is the name of the herb, Chuan Xiong. This is the king herb of this formula. And Cha means tea. Chai tea latte, the tea, Cha. So when you say Chai tea, it means tea tea, tea tea. Likewise, automobile car, cha tiao. So this formula is chan shong powder with green tea. So it is served with green tea, instead of green tea. So cha ye is uh, one of the main ingredients too. So chan shong and cha ye, chan shong cha tiao san. And gan zhou is there, and all the other herbs Inside are all releasing exterior herbs, like a common cold herbs. Bo He, Bai Jie, Jing Jie, Fang Feng, and Qiang Huo, and Xi Xin. Bo He is peppermint, and Bai Jie release the wind and also release the nasal blockage. And Jing Jie, Fang Feng is commonly used releasing exterior herbs with cold property. I know you guys learned this Jingjie Fang Feng is a warming and releasing exterior herb, but it has very moderate property. So they can be used in cold and warm formulas. And Shishin warms, and Qiang Ho releases dampness and wind. So this part releases exterior, and Chan Shong and Cha Ye. As you can see here, let's see the ingredients. And Bo He is one of the main ingredients. Obviously, Chan Xiong is the king herb of this formula. So both 12 grams and 12 grams. And Jing Jie is included in large amount. So Bo He and Cha Ye, both of them, has a kind of refreshing, very refreshing taste. And Chan Xiong usually it invigorates blood but also it releases the wind, dispel wind. So Chan Xiong is one of the key herbs for the headache. When you have a headache, and all these are Bai Xi, expel wind, Fang Feng, release exterior, Jing Jie, release exterior, and Qiang Hu, release exterior, Xi Xin, release exterior too, and Gan Zhou. Very simple composition. So remember Chan Xiong and Cha, tea, and other releasing exterior herbs. Action, disperse wind and release headache. So headache caused by wind. So it is kind of light. 
comes and goes and may be related to your common cold symptoms, those headache. So headache by exterior wind and headache, aversion to wind or cold. A slight fever, not necessarily. And with nasal obstruction, we have bite here. And some body ache, so exterior symptoms and headache. Tongue and purse, thin and white and superficial. And preparation, fine ground powder with green tea, chai. And Chanshong Cha Tiao San is the most frequently formula by TCM doctors in Taiwan for migraine patient. So when you treat the headache patient, Chanshong Cha Tiao San is one of the most common choice. But here, I want to comment. Here it says superficial, but it doesn't have to be necessarily superficial. Because TCM doctors, modern TCM doctors, just interpret this releasing their herbs for treating cold. So here you can find a lot of cold-like symptoms, but Qian Shong Cha Tiao San can be used without those cold symptoms and without those superficial purse. It can be used with or without those superficial purse or cold-like symptoms. As long as it is the headache by wind, light and sudden and comes and goes, headache. So this is the mild and kind of first choice formula for any kind of headache. So it has a very wide spectrum of the indication. And it also says it is contraindicated to qi deficiency and especially it is contraindicated with wind heat. So they say this formula should not be used for kind of warm property patient. So this because this formula has a lot of warming herbs. Is it true? But it is not true either. If it is a very warming property formula, it cannot be most prescribed formula in a certain country. Here is a big misunderstanding about this formula. Most of the herbs inside actually warms. That is true. But Fang Feng and Jing Jie these two herbs are not that warm. Those herbs are commonly combined with cooling formulas and cooling herbs. And actually, Bohe has a cooling property. And Chanshong, they say it is warm but arguable. And most of the herbs inside are not that warm or not that cold, just like Jingjie and Fang Feng. Only one herb has a very strong, not that strong, but clearly warming property is this Shishin. Besides Shishin, all other herbs are kind of moderate. So saying this formula is not good for heat property patient, heat property symptoms, is not fair. You cannot say the characteristic of the formula by its only numbers, number of the composition. That doesn't make sense. As I evidence, I will show you some ancient text which says this formula is used for warm heat condition. First, this is from Tan Gok Gyeongwonbang and this is from Yi Xue Roman in Ming Dynasty. Both of them says Chan Xiong Cha Tiao San for both condition, cold and heat. It says some formula called Xiao Feng San is for heat and Ju Feng Shan for cold. A is for heat. And B is for cold, but this Chan Xiong Cha Tiao San can be used for both conditions, heat or cold. And another reference here, this book says Chan Xiong Cha Tiao San can be used tear with heat signs. So it is like an eye infection with the heat signs like congestions and tears. Chan Xiong Cha Tiao San can be used. As you can see here in ancient text, Chan Xiong Cha Tiao San has been used cold or heat, sometimes specifically cold, sometimes specifically heat condition too. So you don't have to differentiate this formula with certain heat or cold black and white manner. 
Yin and Yang is not binary. That is a very common misunderstanding of Yin and Yang. That is not binary, like a zero and one. It can be between one and zero, and always Yang has Yin inside, Yin has Yang inside. That is the reason we draw the Tai Chi with this diagram. They always move, and they are always mixed. So one textbook says, because this formula is wrong, we should not use this formula for wind hit, but that is so wrong. As you can see here, this formula has been used wind hit signs too. But as I always emphasize, for the board examination, please remember this formula as a superficial formula. So superficial floating or superficial for floating purse and warming formula for board examination. But for your practice, please remember this. This is the most commonly used formula for mild and comes and goes headache. That is Chan Xiong Cha Piao San. So release wind and Chan Xiong and green tea. Next formula, Chang Er Ji San. Chang Er Ji is the name of the herb inside. And let's see the composition first. Chang Er Ji disperse wind and then and unblock nasal orifices. And Shen Yi, this is flower, magnolia flower. This one also release wind and unblock nostril. And Bai Ji does the same thing too. So all this thing specifically treat nasal blockage and also expel wind. So all these herbs release exterior. But these three herbs more focused on releasing nasal blockage. And bohe chongbai. Bohe is a peppermint, so release wind heat. And chongbai is a green onion, green onion. So bohe has a cooling property and chongbai has a warming property. And shinyi also has a warming property. And changerji is a cockle bird. You can find around your mountains, something stick to your clothes. And cockle bird plant is bitter, sweet, warm, and slightly poisonous. And it dispel wind and cold. Wind and cold, so slightly warm, and treat the stuffy nose. And also headache caused by wind cold too. In Western herbology, cockle bird plant is mainly used for uterine bleeding, deep abscess, leprosy, and skin tinea, and eczema. So there's a cockle burr and sini this is a magnolia flower so these are the ingredients so composition is very simple release exterior and the herbs release nasal blockage so similar composition with chan shong cha tiao san so two side treat the branch and treat the root or treat the symptom and treat the pattern. Treat the symptom and treat the pattern. Nasal blockage and release wind. Same thing goes. Treat the headache and release the wind. Release the wind, treat the headache. This side, release wind and treat nasal blockage. That is Chang Er Ji San. And show Ho Lo Dan. Ho Lo means open the channel. So this formula composed of warming herbs and releasing flame herbs and releasing wind herbs and invigorating blood herbs. So it treat the chronic B syndrome, chronic, this is important keyword, with the cold. I made a separated clip about Xiao Hu Long Dan. Please check that clip for detailed explanation. So let's skip to Next formula, Xiao Feng San. Xiao Feng San means eliminate wind powder. So it is related to wind too. So same composition, releasing exterior part, wind part, and treating skin part. So how can we treat the skin problems? With subsiding heat. So Shigao Jimu Di Huang Mutong 
cushion. So di huang mu tong ju ye, that is da chi san, dao chi san. Release, hurt it. And shi go ji mu, this is the main component of bai hu tang. So these two herbs release stomach heat. So stomach heat and heart heat. And cushion also clear heat. So all this part clears heat. So Xiao Feng San is a combination of Bai Hu Tang and Tao Chi San to release heart and stomach heat. So upper body heat. And to extinguish fire effectively, nourishing in herbs are commonly combined, like Dang Gui, here, Dang Gui and Hei Chi Ma. Those herbs nourish in to help the function of clearing heat by adding water. So I gave you a knowledge about this. This is like a fire hydrant and these are the fire engines to clear heat. And these herbs release exterior. Let's see the individual herbs. Jing Jie Fang Feng, common herb for any kind of exterior symptoms. Those are not that warm or not that hot. And new Bang Ji clears wind heat, so it has a cooling property. And Chuan Tui also has a cooling property. So I told you, many people think Jing Jie Fang Feng is a warming herb, but actually Jing Jie Fang Feng is combined with this cooling, dispersing wind and heat herbs to release the exterior. So Xiao Feng San is a cooling formula. And there are herbs like uh, Shigao and Jimu as a Bai Hu Tang to treat stomach heat. And Sheng Di Huang and Mu Tong to treat heart heat as a Tao Chi San. And Ku Sen also clear heat. And these herbs totifies in Tangui and Hejima. And here's one here's one specific herb, Changchu. Changchu release dampness. Why? Because eczema, a lot of skin problem has the heat signs with the dampness, so to speak, oozing or swelling. So with these cooling herbs. Changchu helps releasing those inflammations by drying dampness, oozing of the skin, oozing of the skin, or the swelling of the skin. This is Xiaofeng San. Let's check this diagram again. Chuan Tui, Niu Bangji, Jingjie, Fangfeng, all this release wind heat and clear heat with Bai Hu Tang, Dao Chi San, and tonifying inner herbs like Dang Gui. And Chantry is there to release the dampness, to subside the swelling. So expel wind and clear heat. Expel wind and clear heat. Actually, this is a very common composition of all kinds of formulas for skin disease. What did I say? Release exterior and clear heat. All kinds of skin problems. This is the most commonly used composition of those formulas. Xiao Feng San. This is Xiao Feng San. Release wind, eliminate wind powder. So you don't have to stick to all the ingredients inside. Just remember, just intuitively understand this formula. Release exterior, wind heat, and also clear heat. With what? Bai Hu Tang and Dao Chi San. This is a one sentence summary of composition of Xiao Feng San. Bai Hu Tang, Dao Chi San. Action. Disperse wind and eliminate dampness with Chan Chu and cools heat, especially of the blood. And skin disease with wind damp heat. Wind, Jing Jie, Fang Feng, Chan Tui, and damp, Chang Chu, heat, Dao Chi San, and Bai Hu Tang. So weepy, itchy, oozing, red skin lesions, so eczema. So this is for heat and acute condition. So yellow heat, all white with the dampness, and flooring for exterior. Forceful means this is excessive condition, rapid, 
So when you give this formula, let the patient not to take spicy or hot food. This food counteract with this formula because this is a cooling formula. And greasy food also generate heat. So you should let them, let the patient avoid these specific foods. And this formula is not for deficiency condition. So these are the formulas commonly used for skin. And this formula has something in common. Sheng Ma, Gag and Tang also has a part release exterior, and Xiao Feng San also has a part release exterior, and Fang Feng Tong Shen San also has a part releasing exterior. And they all have the part clearing heat, clearing heat, and clearing heat. So Sheng Ma, Gag and Tang is for excessive wind more, and Xiao Feng San, wind and heat, around the same amount. And Fang Feng Tong Shen San is more focusing on heat. And these are the herbs for releasing exterior in three formulas, among three formulas for Sheng Ma, Gag and Tang, usually used for hives without much of heat signs, so itching and ache to hives. And Xiao Feng San, kind of larger spectrum of indication. And Fang Feng Tong Shen San, this is for heat, obviously heat. And clearing heat herbs in Sheng Ma Gegen Tang only Qi Xiao. This is for dampness and blood stasis. So not that cold. But Xiao Feng San, we have Bai Hu Tang and Dao Qi San. And Fang Feng Tong Shen San, Shi Gao, Da Huang. Da Huang is here. And Huang Qin and Lin Chao, more strong herbs for clearing heat. Okay, let's talk about other formulas releasing internal heat of a liver yang in the next time. See you later.